You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. Calico! You were talking in your sleep. Weirdo. <laughs> Not now, I got work to do. song. I wrote it. Years ago. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force from the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No. But I knew your master, Jaro Tapal. He was a true guardian of the Republic. He was a hero. Listen, something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. It's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up on our destination. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists? No. So, what's the plan? Will you hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. I'm looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, why does Seer need me? This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus my mind.
Hey, BD-1. I'm Kel. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on! Did you just slice that? Thanks. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. I sense something over here. That's a really big bug. after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. No way through here. Guess that's why BD-1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. The zip line? Whoa! How'd you know that would work? Wait, you didn't? Doesn't look safe. Just like back at the scrapyard. Hold on, BD1. I'm coming.
Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. That was pretty brave. You okay? Wait, I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh, <laughs> okay. Hmm. Well, your scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. Okay, try that. The vault? Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay, well, first we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Uh, BD, that's a little small for me. Don't worry, I'll find my own way out. Tight fit, but this should work. Those vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. That's where we need to go. I can feel it. Chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? Oh, something was in there. Don't fall behind, BD1. everywhere we've been. <laughs> I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way.
are you going? Did you find something, BD1? Tool was used by someone eager to reach the vault. Can't get it to work. I'll check it out. See something in there? Master? Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but with persistence and the Force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. You will master any path. Now, do what you must to reach me. Again. Faster. More intensity. I 
did it. Persistence and the Force is my ally. Just remembering old tricks. You can show me that shortcut again. This area was used for meditation by someone familiar with the Jedi Order. again? Help me, BD! This? Sorry about your scalp link. But standing up to that bog rat, pretty brave.
Gracie there? Oh, it's on. We're not finished yet. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. Probably. What? What'd you find? Amazing. You all right, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left behind and gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Ino Cordova. I may not know your name, but I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place, this vault, is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the Zephyr. Meditating here, I was granted a premonition through the Force, a vision of doom. I have placed inside this vault a Jedi holocron, containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the force be with you. I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. Hey, you want to meet some uh, friends of mine?
think I found what you wanted me to see. Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. My friend, it appears the Sefo had some interest in Dathomir. Strange. For such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. looking. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. Okay, I'll look. You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? <laughs> Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? <laughs> get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Don't get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Patoli weed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. 
A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Dathomir is Zepho. It's your choice. If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. Hey, Grease, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you betcha. But when it's behind a comfortably thick wall of embar and glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any.
Seer, can you feel the force at all? Yes. But instead of opening up, I push it back down. The exact opposite of what you should do. Out there, I remembered something about myself before the purge. It was painful, but like I found a piece of myself. That's good. You're learning to embrace the Force again. How can you say that? Because I know what it means to live without it. Okay. I'll keep trying. Later, Cal. Please. Setting course for death. Wait a minute. You want to go to Dathomir? I'm surprised Cordova went there. He must have had good reason. I am staying put on the Manus once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. This place used to be home to a powerful cabal of Force wielders known as the Night Sisters. They use the Force? What, like Jedi? No. These witches served only themselves. Their powers focused on deception, illusion. Manipulation. Huh. Sounds like someone I used to know. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Dathomir is a deadly place. We should be careful. Don't have to tell me twice. Ah, coming up on our creepy destination. Grab some seat, kid. Careful here. This is a deadly, dangerous place. I'm prepared to face anything. I know you are, Cal. One of the many reasons BD-1 trusted you with Cordova's information. We're lucky to have you. Do you know anything about the Night Sisters of Dathomir? I knew a little. Many Jedi weren't even aware of their existence, but being Cordova's apprentice came with some unique insight. He always thought they were interesting, as he did with most ancient cultures. And what did you think? I never came here. I never wanted to. As I recall, that was about the time the two of us began going our separate ways. The darkness always has an effect, one way or another. BD-1, keep an eye on Cal for us. It's okay, Grease. You'll be okay. You're with Jedi. It's safe. <laughs> I'm safe. Who's there? Oh, Cal. Whew. Are we ready to go? Just checking on you. I'm fine. Just fine. Just very much ready to get off this planet. I've heard the stories. Witches, living dead. Don't you have a job to do? Come on already. I'll get right on it. Okay, good. Hurry it up. I'll be right here where it's safe. If there is such a place.
get some help? On the men. Brothers, an intruder! Prepared to die, Jedi? He's running away! And I coward! Got a scan? What'd you find? Hi, brothers. <laughs> Don't let him evade you. Come, brother. <laughs> I won't 
hail you brothers. drawn to something here. Energy from the ruins? Oh! 
a fellow wanderer. I see you met the resident knight, sister, but uh, unlike most, you're alive. <laughs> what lightsaber? No, no, don't hide it. That would explain your survival. Who are you? You know, no, no one to fear. <laughs> Just a traveler, studying the nature of extinct cultures and dead philosophies. You study the Night Sisters? I study many things. But yes, that Night Sister, well, she was only a child when the war came to this world. She had to watch her whole family perish. What do you know about those ruins? Oh, oh. Ancient beyond belief. The Night Sister and her warrior kin were seduced by the power that lurks within. Avoid the ruins. Or suffer the same thing. <laughs>